what is build and deployment process for every project development team will be available so it may be a java development team or dotnet development team or python development team development team is responsible to develop the code required for the project based on the client requirement development team will write the source code of the project so in a team multiple developers will be available and those developers will be available in different different locations some members in hyderabad location some members in bangalore or some members in us location like that so development team will work from different different locations depends on the situation all these developers code will be stored at one place that is called source code management tool github or bitbucket there are several source code management softwares are available in the market we need to take the code from the github and we need to deploy the code in the server so that is called build and deployment process for every project build and deployment process is mandatory so what is that build and deployment process we need to take latest source code from the github so developers will write the code developers will keep the code in the github we need to take that latest source code from the github and we need to compile that project source code so dot java files will be available in the github so we need to download that source code from the github we need to compile that source code then byte code will be generated once the byte code is generated we need to execute unit test cases so whatever the j units that we have implemented in the project those j units we need to execute those j units we need to execute and perform code review using sonar cube what are the mistakes done by the developers we can identify those mistakes by using sonar cube then upload the build artifact into nexus we need we will package the application that whatever the package is created it may be a jar file or it may be a war file that packaged file we need to upload into nexus upload the build artifact into nexus repository then finally deploy the application in server so this is called build and deployment process once we deploy the application in the server then users can access now we are accessing www.facebook.com www.gmail.com so this is called build and deployment process